Hey, what's up? This is Tim with Tactics, and I'm here to help you choose some skateboard bearings. Bearings are placed into the sides of the wheels and allow them to spin freely on the axle. Skateboard bearings have been standardized, so you don't have to worry about getting the right bearing size. Any skate brand bearing should fit in any skateboard wheel. The first spec you might see is the ABEC rating. ABEC is an industrial rating that measures the bearing's tolerances and physical limits, but that test doesn't take into consideration all the factors that are present in skateboarding, such as impact from jumping down stairs or lateral stress from power sliding. That means a higher ABEC rating doesn't necessarily make the bearing better. We recommend first looking at the quality of the bearing's materials and design. Ceramic bearings are fast and smooth, with the advantage that the balls don't rust if they get wet. This makes ceramic bearings great for cruiser setups. Titanium bearings are the strongest, making them durable and highly rust resistant. All bearings will get dirty, so it's important to clean them regularly if you want them to last a long time. Bearings with removable shields make them easier to clean, so it's easier to make them last longer. Lubricating your bearings is also important. There's a lot of different skate-specific bearing lubes out there, but 3-in-1 oil works just fine. One last thing. WD-40 is not a lubricant. It was designed to accelerate water evaporation, so it will leave your bearings bone dry once it evaporates away. It might seem like it works for a little while, but it won't last and your bearings will need some proper lube if you want them to stay fast. If you got any questions at all, leave them in the box below or just give us a call and we'll help you get the answers you need.